Did you know that thalassemia is one of the most common genetic blood disorder affecting millions of people around the world? Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Riaz Ahmed. I am Senior Director, Hematology and BMT in Max Saket Super Specialty Hospital. Thalassemia is a type of blood disorder which affects millions of people. But what exactly is thalassemia? The patient affected by thalassemia have less amount of red blood cells which amount to low hemoglobin. So there are two main types of thalassemia, alpha thalassemia and beta thalassemia. Beta thalassemia is the more common than alpha thalassemia. Again, depending on the symptoms, thal beta thalassemia can be of thalassemia trait or thalassemia minor, uh, thalassemia intermedia or thalassemia major. If a person requires blood transfusion from uh, initial two to three months of its life to maintain his or her hemoglobin, then it's thalassemia major. So how to prevent this thalassemia major and how to treat this thalassemia major? As this is a genetic disorder, what we need to do, we need to do intensive screening. The government of India has started screening of all pregnant females, but as a society, everyone with low hemoglobin should be checked whether they are thalassemic minor or not. And once two thalassemic minor marry, whenever they plan to get uh, the family going on eight to ten weeks of pregnancy, the fetal uh, blood should be checked so that if it is thalassemia major, they can go for abortion. If it is minor or normal, they need to continue the pregnancy. Now coming to the treatment part. The mainstay of thalassemia treatment has been blood transfusion and iron chelation. Blood contains a lot of iron in it. So every time a blood is being given to the patient, iron level keeps on increasing and it can get deposited in the brain, liver, heart, kidney, everywhere in the body. So the patient will have stunted growth. So age may be 15, 16 years, but the look will be of seven, eight years old. So coming to the transfusions, to have normal growth, a person should have minimum hemoglobin of nine to 10 gram percent. And whenever it goes low, it needs a transfusion. So multiple transfusion after 10 transfusion the ferritin level keeps on uh, increasing then you start giving iron chelators to reduce this iron within the body so this has been the mainstay of thalassemia treatment throughout the world what about the cure so the only curative treatment till date is bone marrow transplant so all thalassemia major patients uh, the only way is to get cured by is bone marrow transplant so what is the age of this bone marrow transplant earlier the better so, but still not more than 10 years of age. The success rate can range from 60 to 70 to 90% of the patient can get cured of the disease. And if for more health related issues, you must contact your hematologist or pediatricians for better update. I hope you all find this video informative. If you have any questions, you can write your comments in the section given below. Thank you for watching this video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon to get the latest healthcare updates.